welcome back guys this is uh, question 44 45 in our section 2.9 and here what i have to do i have to convert each octal number to their binary counterpart okay so what we have to do here we have the octal number okay first of all i have to convert it to the decimal number okay and after decimal we can very easily convert it to their binary counterparts okay so let me start it from this part a so 17 with the base 8 now the decimal equivalent of it will be 1 multiplied by 8 okay similarly 7 multiplied by 8 and we have already seen that how to convert any octal number to their decimal counterpart so writing it 0 and then 1 okay what I will get 1 multiplied by 8 is 8 okay and 7 multiplied by 8 as per 0 is 7 okay and this will be 15 in decimal so this is the decimal equivalent of my number which is here and now to convert it to their binary equivalent what I have to do let me write here 2 0 2 1 2 2 2 3 2 4 2 5 2 6 and 2 7 okay so now writing uh, this is 2 response um, 4 so this is 16 so this is higher than this so 8 plus 4 is 12 plus uh, 2 is 14 and plus 1 is 15 okay so that is what that is the binary equivalent of my number which is now 17 and the binary equivalent of 15 is now 111 okay so the binary equivalent of it is 1111 in the binary okay so that is the answer of part a similarly uh, now solving part b of my question what i have to do i have to write here what i have to do i have to again use the same procedure what i have used here okay so for part b here i have here 26 in octal okay this is in octal now to convert it to the decimal what i have to do 2 multiplied by the base plus 6 multiplied by the base where this 2 is this one while 6 is this one which is mentioned here okay so starting from 0 and then 1 here and let me simplify it what i will get this is 8 multiplied by 2 is 16 plus 6 multiplied by 1 because 8 as per 0 is 1 so 1 multiplied by 6 is 6 here i will get 22 in the decimal okay so this is the decimal equivalent of my number what I have to do now, I have to convert it to the binary and the procedure I have been using here is basically the sum of the product rule. Okay, so 2 raised to the power 4 is 16. Okay, 16 plus 8 is 24. So, it is not possible to make it 1. So, this is 0. This is 4. So, 16 plus 4 is 20 and this one is 22. So, now writing this one is this one. So, that is now the binary equivalent of my number okay so the part b i had 26 in the octal while the binary equivalent of it is 10110 okay so that is the binary equivalent of my number similarly now using the same procedure for 145 in the octal as well okay so now let me use the same procedure this is uh, part c and in part c i have 145 in octal okay uh, converting it to the decimal so 1 multiplied by 8 plus 4 multiplied by 8 plus 5 multiplied by 8 okay starting from 0 1 and then 2 so what i will get here this will be 1 multiplied by 8 8 64 okay 4 multiplied by 8 plus 5 multiplied by 1 okay so here i will have 5 plus 32 plus 64 okay so how much would it be so this is 32 plus 64 96 96 plus 4 96 plus 5 is 101 okay so that is the decimal equivalent of my number 
now uh, to find the binary equivalent of my number this one what I have to do now let me write their weights here uh, so 2 raised power 6 is uh, 64 okay this is 2 raised power 5 is 32 okay this is 32 this is now 4 32 and uh, this is now 1 is left so this is 1 okay so this is now the binary equivalent of my number which is 145 so the this is part c so the binary equivalent of 145 which is in octal is now 0 1 1 0 0 okay and 1 0 1 this is the binary number in my number system okay so we have solved these three questions part a part b part c uh, so uh, the part d procedure i have followed here will remain same for part d part e and part f as well so give it them a try and you will see that it is quite convenient and easy method for converting any octal number to their binary counterparts okay so that's it for today and i will see you with some more questions like this one in our upcoming video thank you so much and see you soon